Hi everybody, welcome to Live Blogger. In this video, I'll show you how to modify your tags or elements in your blogger theme. So for example, here we can see we have this uh, heading. And if I right click over here and click on inspect, here we can see this is an S3. Now if you want to change this S3 into an H1, then you have to go to the theme code and make some changes in that. So in this video, I'll show you how to do that. Let's get started. <laughs> Now the first thing you need to do is uh, you need to see how the element is uh, structured and what are the classes that the element has. So here we can see this is an S3 and here we have these classes. We have the post title class and the entry title class. So we have to search for these classes in our template code. So let's go back to our dashboard and let's go to theme. And by the way, I'm using this theme called Contempo Light, which comes by default with Blogger. You can do this with all the themes that you have. So let's click on this arrow and click on edit HTML. And now here we can see this is the theme code of our blogger theme. And uh, we need to search for class, post title and entry title. So we have to find this exact line of code. Now most probably you have to change this double course into single course when you search for this. So let's press command F or control F to bring this search field and let's type class equals and in single quotes let's type post title and entry title so let's type post title entry title and let's close the single quotes and uh, let's close the angle brackets and let's press enter and now here we can see we have this s3 and uh, we have the same classes over here so these lines of code are most probably what is displaying over here as this heading now sometimes there may be other elements with the same classes so you have to make sure that this is the exact element so if i search for it again and if i press enter we can see that we are going to the same place so now we know that this is the exact element now if you search for this and if you find multiple instances of these classes then you can try changing each of those elements and uh, make sure which of the element is displayed over here and then reset all the other elements but for now we know that this is the element so let's change this s3 into an h1 and we have to change the ending tag as well and now let's save it and now let's go back to our website and let's refresh this page and now let's right click over here on the heading and click on inspect and now we can see this is an h1 so that's basically how you can change any of these elements to whatever you want in your theme code now let me also show you one more thing so let's go back to the index page and here we have these headings now for these headings we will also add an icon before the headings so let's see how to do that we will add the icon to just the headings of the index page and not for the headings of these posts over here so let's go back to our main page and let's right click over here and click on inspect and now here we can see we have this h1 and inside that we have this anchor tag and for this also we have the same classes so let's go back and search for the same thing and if we take a look at this we can see that there's an if condition over here and in this if condition we have this anchor tag so here we can see we have this anchor tag inside this h1 so outside the if condition we have the title so this line of code is for the post and this is for the anchor tag so here inside this if condition Let's type something over here. So let's type testing and save this. And now let's go back and let's refresh this page. And here we can see it says testing. And if you open any of these posts, here for this heading, we don't have testing displayed. So now we can go ahead and add anything we want over here. So I'll just show you how to add an icon over here. So for that, we will use a website called heroicons.com. And here I'll just search for an icon. Let's search for a share icon. And let's copy the SVG. And let's go back over here. And here instead of testing, let's just add the SVG. And now if we save this and if you go back to our website, let's refresh this page. And now we can see we have this icon over here. Let's just decrease the height of the icon. So let's go back to our code. And here I'll just add some inline CSS. So let's type style equals. And let's set the height to 18 pixels. And let's save it. 
and let's go back to our post and let's refresh this page and now we can see we have the correct height for the icon and if you open any of these posts we don't have the icon over here so that's basically how you can change or modify any of the elements in your blogger theme so that's it for this video if you have any doubts you can ask in the comments below and if you like this video please click on the like button and subscribe to this channel to get the latest video updates thanks a lot for watching have a nice day Oh, 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 oh,